And so it was written, the age of enlightenment began and humankind transformed their culture of death into a culture of life. They realized that raw living fruits and vegetables. Seriously, but it's pretty cool that there's a Tibetan prayer flag stupa, I don't know what you'd call this, altar. I offered my cherry. <laughs> and uh, there's a view of the mountains, sweet. And here's a view of me and the city. So I really, uh, Salt Lake is, it's, I've got a love-hate relationship with it. It's so dry, you got a desert, but you got the mountains. And uh, well, I think Michael's path is to live here for a little while so I think I'll be out here uh, well I'll be moving out here in the next month or so going down to the raw spirit fest in Arizona and uh, even before that I'm going out to Oregon and then back here and then down there and then back here and then who knows but I want to be here for the winter because I'm a snowboarder too and I love the backcountry so uh, but I think the valley, this valley needs a lot of healing. Probably one of, I mean, especially with, you know, female healing. Just all that, all that polygamy that, that happened. And yeah, the, the female energy is pretty intense here. It, but it's a good thing. I like it. It's, I need that healing too. It's, it, and it's almost like this could be the epicenter. I don't know. I don't know. It is nice out here because you've got the nature, but I think that's what they call a dichotomy where, or the yin and yang, you see it very abruptly here. So I, I would definitely love to explore the mountains. I don't know if I could live in the city, uh, maybe live up by a ski resort or something. So that was my thought. I'm definitely going to get into trail running because mountain biking is just too aggro. I mean, I love it. And uh, that's really how I got my toxicity out. Is That's how I made my transformation. It's always kind of been there as my anchor. Uh, so it'll always be a part of me. But I'm ready to move on to something a little more intense like trail running or who knows what else you don't really you can't label yourself or else you just become stuck in a rut well I'd love to talk more but I've got to go down this mountain this is a beautiful Sunday morning I'm thinking of going to the Salt Lake City superheroes meeting it's apparently a, a raw food gathering up at Rose Sachs Gardens, wherever that is. It looks a little, it looks nice, but I'm supposed to bring a dish and I'm not, I just eat, I'm really tending towards the fruits and juicing and just keeping it really light because I love exercising. I mean, that's really my, I guess that's my karma because I have, I've got to deal with, to make my, to make my living, I have to deal with computers and to balance that, I need to get outside and really exercise and get the blood flowing, and the lymph flowing, and the oxygen. And I think uh, computers probably. I've, a friend once told me that it has positive ions or negative ions. Don't don't take my word on that, but it would it makes sense to it would drain some sort of energy from you just sitting in front of a computer all day long in the in an office environment with filtered air and not really you know so that's about that I am out of here sayonara sign off later